Elter, Integrated European Long-Term Ecosystem, Critical Zone, and Socio-Ecological Research. Elter is able to give us data and access to sites that are suffering from climate change and biodiversity loss, and in this way try to understand what is happening, how they are interacting, what we can do to mitigate these changes. I think that the unique position of ELTER is that we are able to draw policy relevant conclusions from the measurements and monitoring that we have been doing. The whole system approach allows for uh, combining data in new ways and learning uh, more from it than we normally would. This also applies to data that is currently scattered across different databases and people believe that there is no way to connect it. But using the eco uh, ecologically meaningful uh, linkages that the whole system approach allows, we actually can uh, gain more with less. Elter will have a chance to really um, assess and evaluate the, the, the changes of the environment over time. Contributing to provide information to policy and decision makers to make uh, to improve uh, the decisions made and the action taken, not only in protected areas but also in other areas uh, where have intensive use of uh, resources. And also providing this information to, to citizens and NGOs and other users that could use that information in their daily activities to improve also their decisions and maybe influence the, how they behave and become more environmentally sustainable. The ELTER conceptual framework is helping scientists in our country work with communities to resolve local problems. Uh, so we have stakeholder groups uh, working on issues of agriculture and climate change, working on conflicts between pastoralists and nature reserves authorities, uh, and looking for sustainable solutions to different environmental challenges at the local level. 